great game tonight against the Eagles. How do you rate your overall team performance? Uh, overall, I think we had a pretty good game. We had a few lapses on defense, uh, one to start the game and another later on in the game. But other than that, I think we should be really proud of ourselves. Individually, you had a really strong game tonight. Uh, what can we expect from you next week against uh, Sheffield? Um, over the last couple of weeks, my confidence has been building in practice, and I think uh, just expect me to be more aggressive and attack the basket more and on defense. Uh, my rotations on the help side have been pretty good, and I just want to keep that up and help the team get stops. Zach, really solid second half today. Uh, what are your thoughts on the overall game? Yeah, it was a very good game. I think we competed with them very well. Um, we've shown that we can compete and play with the very best as Newcastle are. Um, with a game like that, it just comes down to very minor details and a few mistakes here and there just um, gave them the advantage in the end. Obviously, some strong performances. Uh, we've had Worcester last week, uh, Eagles this week. What do you think you can expect from next week and the year overall? Well, yeah, we've got um, Sheffield that are a reasonably good team next week. And I think it's been good to play some higher order teams um, recently. We've learned a lot. We've built a lot. So I think going forward, we can definitely look to be in that playoff position that we want and just keep competing and hopefully snatch some wins from the higher order teams. So a close one against the top team in the league. What are your thoughts of the game and where can we improve? I mean... You know, uh, Newcastle are a perennial contender. I think, um, you know, the evidence is out there. They're, they're uh, well-rounded, accomplished players, um, holding four titles currently and unbeaten in the league. Um, and we showed out against them tonight. I think I think the boys have a lot to be proud of. I think, although we made uh, a number of mistakes at key junctures, the reality was we were in the game and we were in the game throughout it. And in contrast to the beginning of the year when we matched up with them, um, where it was a 35, 40 point deficit, uh, I think we've come a long way and I think it bodes well for the new year. The previous game against Newcastle was around a 30 point split. How do you reduce a margin against the most storage franchise in the BBL? Well, I think, you know, uh, we've, we've done a lot of scouting. I think um, our defence is improving. I think our offensive execution is improving. Um, we had a good performance against Worcester last week. And when you're competing with the top three, it gives you a lot of confidence. It gives you a lot of uh, confidence in what we're, we're putting down on the floor. And I think the guys needed that. And you, you've seen bigger and better performances from multiple players. Clayfell was outstanding tonight. Rob was as consistent as ever. Um, Zach Wells stepped up in the second half big time. And I think uh, as a unit we're growing and the understanding uh, of one another is growing. And, and once you've got to that point, I think you can really push on. And uh, I think if you ask me where we are right now, um, or ask me about where we, where we could be right now at the beginning of the season, I think I would have prob probably pegged us a few steps back. So um, I'm really excited about what um, the future holds. and. I'm, in terms of Sheffield next week, it's a White Rose derby and uh, I think exciting times. I think it'll be one for the fans.